Alpha Fill. This is Alphabet Fill. With this tool, we can write alphabets as a stitch. In the design, press Alpha Fill button. Here, you type alphabet as your need. Here, you can see, stitch spacing, height, and width. Here, we set height 30 millimeters, and width will set automatic, as a percentage with height. Here, you can see, default font style. Set parameter, as per your need, and press OK. Here, you can see, the mouse cursor is a pencil, and drag the pencil, where you want to draw alpha fill. Here, you can see, alphabets are filled, with satin stitch effects. Here, you can see, alphabets in a branch. Now, if we want to, break these alphabets branches. Press, break branches button. Here, you can see, all alphabets are broken, from branches. Let's see again. Enter your text here. Now, we set a two-point line, in the input type. Now, drag a pencil at two points, with mouse left click, where you want to draw. We can also break, the alphabet from branches, by pressing Ctrl plus B shortcut key. Let's see again. Enter your text here. Now, we set a three-point arc, in the input type. Now, drag a pencil at three points, with mouse left click, where you want to draw. Here, you can see, alphabets are filled, with satin stitch effects. Now, if we want to, set angle in the alphabet. Enter your text here. And set, italic angle as per your need. Drag the pencil, where you want to draw. Here, you can see, italic angle set in the alphabet. Now, if we want to, draw the alphabet with an outline. Click on, Outline Alphabet button. Here, you can see, alphabets with an outline. Now, if we want to, break these alphabets branches, press, Ctrl plus B shortcut key. Here, you can see, all alphabets are broken, from branches. Now, if we want to, draw the alphabet with an outline drawing. Turn on, outline drawing button, an outline alphabet button, and turn off splitted alphabets button, and drag a pencil, where you want to draw. Here, you can see, the alphabet with an outline drawing, 